So this is a winner for the free huge bet for my previous video. If you guys do want a free huge bet, all you gotta do is like, subscribe, and comment down below that you want a free huge bet. Here's a huge bet that is not a huge rock. And make sure you guys watch this video till the end. And here you go, bro. Go check a mailbox. It should be there. You can do whatever you want with it. Now let's get into the video. Hotshot69 currently owns the only death pet in the entire game. Yes, there is an admin pet, aka death pet, that you can literally get in Pet Simulator 99. I'll be explaining how he actually got this death pet because it's actually pretty interesting and also what is happening with that death pet is it deleted it did it get taken away by preston what happened to this pet so this death pet that i'm talking about is called the huge pixel wolf it's actually been seen in game multiple times by a lot of different people people literally saw it in the trading plaza servers of hotshot 69 trying to trade this pet and from my knowledge it's the only one that's in the game that's not owned by a developer so he had serial number four which is i'm guessing the first ever one to exist not counting one two and three because those are most likely developers since we've never seen any images of those pets nor have we seen any of those other ones in the game by the way in case you guys didn't know on the big game store they were literally selling a medium dragon pillow for only a dollar and you can literally add this to your cart but now it's sold out and now it's coming soon so i'm pretty sure it was a mistake from the big games team I literally tweeted about this the moment it happened, and Spiffy replied, he's like the uh, head of merch, like the merch things that happen for big games. He said, what is steal? And then everyone else said that it doesn't ship to their address, does it work for you and everything like that because it wasn't working for a lot of people. And some people actually said you have to buy other things. And then some other people said that it actually worked for them and it's coming soon uh, to their mail. So I don't know if it actually worked. I didn't try it for myself because I wanted to record this video and then buy it on the video. But by the time I was recording this video, big games developers already fixed it and it's not a dollar anymore. So yeah, that kind of sucks. Anyway, let's get into this dev pet. So if you go over here in the index and try to search up like hot dog pet like this pet right here that only has one exists which is most likely admin pet in the pet index it says how you can get that pet found in season two merch gifts and if you search up huge purple dragon it also says the same thing found in season two merch gifts and you can find this pet as only a shiny and one exists and then if you go search up the other pet that this guy has well i'll go search up huge pixel wolf and it's not there there's only like huge pixel cat and everything like that there's no huge pixel wolf that that guy owns and if you look at it four of them exist because he has serial number four so if four of the pets exist why is it not in the pet index and you know what i was like okay maybe it's not in the pet index it's maybe in the trading terminal so i went to the trading plaza and then went to the trading terminal right over here and then search up huge pixel wolf and still not even here bro so you cannot find this pet anywhere nor in the trading terminal or in the index so so this has to be an admin pet or an unreleased pet that literally a normal player got by accident. Because it's either they got it by accident, they got it by mistake, or they literally hacked and got this pet. Or maybe very lucky, but maybe they got the pet from a developer. So I was like, okay, I gotta find out who this Hotshot69 guy is, and hopefully he's online. Because I've gotten so many DMs and images of this pet. So I have this first image that was actually blurred out without the dude's name hotshot69 and then i asked dark right here do you know who has this ace has seen that already i said do you know who has it and he gave me this image showing the actual redeemer of this pet so pretty much the image not blurring out saying hotshot69 so that when i saw hotshot69 i was like okay dude that is perfect we could actually go try to find this guy and then here he is right over here as you guys see people were actually trading him and he showed that pet and it literally says dev pet three exists but he has serial number four so instead of three exists it should actually be four exists so i went to the big games discord server and over here i searched up huge pixel wolf to see if anyone knows the actual owner of this pet and there's just people using that same image trying to claim that they own the pet obviously and they actually don't there's only one owner of this pet and that's hotshot69 and yeah i couldn't find anyone unless you go over here and then search up from user and then put hotshot and then you'll get a lot of different 
users. Now, the closest username that I could find was Hotshot97. I mean, it's not Hotshot69, but it's still Hotshot97. So it wasn't a hundred percent that this is the actual owner of the pet, but it was pretty likely. I did find this message of Hotshot97 saying, "Yeah, at Hotshot69, I'm in my private server right now." So this pretty much means that he is Hotshot69, and that really just confirmed it to me that he is the actual owner of this pet, and he is indeed Hotshot69. So right over here, I just start off DMing him and saying, wondering if you have the huge pixel wolf, if he still has it, or maybe he traded it away or something like that. And he said, nah, I got scammed and it got taken. Was trying to help someone with their YT channel, at least I thought I was, and somehow my ready got clicked, and then they clicked theirs, and it wouldn't let me unready, and didn't let him cancel the trade, and he lost all his huges. And he's still pissed about that. I did get them banned though, thankfully, so that's pretty W. Now I was like, okay, that's good. So you lost all your huge pets? And then he said that I lost all 25, so he's restarting now. So that is absolutely insane. And then I was just like, bro, that's actually so dumb because he even got them banned, but all his huge pets are still gone. So it doesn't really make that big of a difference other than that scammer being gone now. So we don't got to worry about the scammer anymore. That's one scammer out of the list. So I was like, okay, he doesn't have it, but how did he even get this pet? So I told him, how did you get it in the first place? And he said, merch code. And I was like, wait, what? Which kind of merch code that? If it's not even game yet and he redeemed a merch code, how did he even get it? He said it was a red dragon collection, but mine didn't come with any merch code, so they gave me replacements. Now, don't go buy the red dragon collection bundle, guys, because that's not exactly how he got this, because he did say that his didn't come with any merch codes, so they gave him replacements. I think that's why I ended up getting it. It was a whole process of providing I bought the collection and that I didn't come with any codes, and then pretty much they gave him a code that gave him that dev hat. So I guess it was an error from whoever like gave him this code whoever refunded him the code or whatever and now that pet is pretty much gone so he actually got it from a merch code that wasn't supposed to be redeemed by him or wasn't even supposed to be given to him so i'm not sure who he actually got this from but if i'm correct and if my theory of this works if i do the exact same thing as him and literally order that same bundle and if I don't get any merch code or any DLC codes from that bundle and I contact that same person that he bought it from that I didn't get a merch code from that bundle, they would give me the same code or maybe that code that gives the huge pixel wolf. I'm guessing they have that code ready for, like, any other merch drops, but, I mean, they shouldn't be giving those things away, especially right now, when it's not even released. So, 100%, that has to be a mistake. And you can see right over here, he lost all of his huge pets here, including the huge pixel wolf, which really sucks. And he actually saw it, he actually took a screenshot when he had serial number 4, and it said 2 exists. Then when they were trading in the trading plaza server, it said three exists. So I'm actually curious. And I want to know, is that pet that he has actually like the only one in the game? Or are there other players that have this pet that we just don't know? Is he one of the first owners of the pet? And maybe developers don't even own it. There's four players out there that have this pet. I mean, I haven't seen anyone with it. So I mean, there's only one way to find out. And that's when people start to get it. And if we could find someone with that pet, but currently, we can't find anyone with that dev pet. I mean, if he was the only person to get this death pet, and it was actually pretty simple, and it was just from a mistake, I mean, it's pretty likely that someone else got the same mistake, and maybe also has this death pet. Obviously, that's not 100%, but it's kind of likely. But as of right now, I don't think anyone has it. I'm pretty sure Hotshot69 just got super duper lucky. By the way, some new enchants also got leaked for the next update, Pets of 99. 
obviously the pets and everything, but not the big. The enchants all look pretty interesting. We got a boss chest enchant, so probably like has a chance of spotting a boss chest. And then we have super shiny enchant, which is most likely, my thinking is, it's probably gonna give you a really good chance on hatching shiny pets. And I'm thinking that these two enchants are probably gonna cost Robux, and the super shiny enchant might cost like a lot of Robux and might have a really big demand. So we might be seeing a lot of people buying these for Robux and then probably selling it for tons of gems. Considering the inflation right now is actually crazy, like exclusive eggs are at 9.37 million. Huge pets are at like 20 million, bro. Like literally for a huge happy rock, it's at 21.2 million rap. So the inflation is absolutely insane. Huge pets are crazy expensive. So maybe when this update releases, huge pets might drop a little in price if there's a lot of ways to get huge pets and if huge pets are a bit easy to get. But I don't know. I kind of highly doubt it. Huge pets probably will stay the same value and just don't increase because of all the inflation that's going on. And especially if there's another way to get a lot of gems or a new gem method releases. Oh, yeah. Then we're seeing crazy inflation. But yeah, as of right now, there's really no way to tell. You know what I should do, though? I should be getting a huge pet for a video. So I already have 61.3 million gems. I literally got all these gems from selling exclusive pets. And, uh, actually, exclusive eggs. And now the value on exclusive pets, uh, eggs, actually went up a lot in value. So kind of sucks. But yo, we got a huge goblet for 21 million. And then we got a huge happy rock for 22 million, bro. So honestly, bro, I'd rather buy this huge goblet for 21 million that's a good price and it's something that's not a huge rock so that's good even though the huge goblet is like pretty trash on in value but still pretty decent also by the way this exclusive egg right here the valentine egg is actually going to be going away next update most likely so if you guys do have the robux probably stack up on these because the value might hold on this since it's like you know a valentine egg and also like the values on these huge pets here are very insane so i feel like the value on these valentine eggs might like stay and might be very valuable just like this emoji egg here it's literally almost 10 million in value and then of course we got the original exclusive egg that's like over 138 million in value i only have two of them and i like opened some of them up so it was kind of a waste but that's okay <laughs> You know, I don't know why people are selling these exclusive eggs for so under the wrap. Honestly, bro, if people are doing this in your server, try swapping servers and then start selling it for wrap. Because I feel like this is just a server where no one's wanting any exclusive eggs at all. So try to find another trading plaza server that does want and then that are willing to buy it for wrap. And then you have a better chance of making a lot more gems and selling your exclusive eggs. Because if I were to sell my exclusive eggs in that server, 100% I am not not selling any here especially since someone literally got it for cheaper there we go that's more like it we got more of an active server here and people selling stuff for very expensive so you know what let's go right over here guys and put this thing over here for 9.3 million i think you'll sell unless the value on these actually dropped and the wrap is just inflated for no reason but yeah, i don't know i mean it's still the wrap and a lot of people still buy a lot of stuff for wrap so I mean, I don't see why not it's selling. You know what I mean? So let's go over here. Selling. I'll just say selling exclusive eggs for under wrap. And then I hope they sell, you know? I'm not going to sell all of them because updates coming out super duper soon. And I want to actually keep some of these. So I'll just sell like a little bit. At least make up my gems I needed for the huge pet. Before, it was like, sell two exclusive eggs for a huge pet. Now, it's doubled, and it's like, you gotta sell four exclusive eggs just to afford a huge pet. All right, guys, I just found someone stealing my sales. This guy right over here is literally saying that he's selling them for 8.8 .8 million each, bro. Ain't no way, bro. They're literally stealing my sales. Wait, why well, I got invited to a clan. Wait, what? I got kicked out the hippo clan? Oh, dude, I didn't even notice. I just, like, logged on. It's, like, literally 10 p.m. for me, and I just logged on, but I guess I got kicked, bro. Rippity rip. Okay, I'll have to figure something out then. Anyway, let me know, like, what clan should I join? And also, let me know, how much are these things selling for then? I mean, the rap is pretty high. 
high, but dude, if no one is like, I don't know if no one bought it. People probably bought it, but uh, this guy's literally selling the eggs for 8.8 .8 million each, bro. Should I sell it right here, over here for 8.7 million? Let's try selling it for 8.7 million over here. There we go. I'd say a uh, selling egg for 8.7 million. That's literally undercutting him. So let's see if this one sells over here. And it actually looks like a lot of, of a lower price because it is 8.69 million. So yeah, that looks like a lot lower. He said, hey, bro, you're literally stealing my sales, bro. Please buy it. Buy, buy it, guys. Please, please buy my egg. Don't buy his egg. Buy mine. Uh-oh. Uh, I think he's changing the sales. He said, selling for one gem beat that. Uh, not really, bro. What? He said, I can't do that. Sorry, hey. Oh, you know what? He said that he can't do it for one gem. You know what? I'll just do it just to put it in his face right here. There we go. One gem, guys. There we go. One gem. One gem, boys. Yes, sir. Let's go. Wait, did he get it? If he got it, that's crazy. No way. No. Oh, okay, good. He didn't get it, guys. Let's go. And then now let's go over here. Hatch these guys open over here. That's a lot of eggs I just wasted because I could have sold all these for a lot of gems. But... Ah, uh, I was hoping I'd get at least a huge pet from that. That would have been pretty W, and that could sell the huge pet, but I couldn't do that, so that's okay. Well, anyway, guys, I'll be end of this video. I hope you guys enjoy. Just like, subscribe, and comment down below any other challenges or games you guys want me to play, and see you later. Peace out. We really need an update.